Hi all, welcome to Parker's Reefs. Sorry it's been so long between videos. I've just been um, pretty busy getting up to date and uh, getting plenty of work done on my tanks. I've just got a um, short video for you today, just a um, real quick update on how my um, soft coral tank's doing. It's got some cool pieces in there and a couple of cute fish, so um, enjoy the show. Cheers. So here it is, it's my um, Red Sea Max 130 tank. It's my um, first ever marine tank, and to be honest, it's, apart from like a nine liter jug, it's my first ever fish tank full stop. Um, I've covered the sort of equipment, or I guess lack of, um, of this tank in previous videos, but I'll just sort of give you a quick um, update on how it's going. Still got my um, my pair of Oki clowns in there, with probably the biggest um, Oki female I've ever ever seen i'm sure someone's got one bigger out there i, I got this um female from a um a hand-me-down uh from a tank that was closing and um i think they'd had her for a few years yen then and i've had her for six years now so i get the impression she's up um into the tens or even teens perhaps uh, i got this cute little bicolor blenny that loves sitting on my morphs all day um to be honest you really most of the day you only ever see my female clown swimming around the um male um, hides the um, bicolor blenny and the um, orchid dotty back lay pretty low until um, until it's feeding time really but uh, it's just enough life um, I, I literally do nothing to this tank other than my auto water changes so I don't want to make it um, too high a by load and um, I guess probably the star of um, this tank is these incredible um, frosted uh, red bubble tips for our American viewers they probably don't think much of these but um in Australia, these things are super rare and um, fetch ridiculous money. I was lucky enough to be able to swap um, a couple of frags for one of these, and um, it's now bred. I think I've got six, maybe seven of these in this tank now, so um, yeah, they're coming along well. But um, I guess uh, this little guy here doesn't really come up well on camera. I've shot this on my um, iPhone, so it's obviously not the best thing for picking up colors, but um, the, the orchid dotty back's a cool little fish. He's pretty secretive, but um, the, the color in person is just so vibrant. The um, purple just glows. It's just a really nice fish to look at. Um, different sort of swim pattern stays low. While the Blenny, obviously, without his swim bladder, likes to sit on things, the, um, the do dotty back just um, kicks about um, this real sort of sniper look in his face. Um, this is down the side of the tank. You can see more of those incredible frosted red bubble tips. I've got a little um, morph stash down here. I think I pan down in a second. I've got a um, dead pool and some other uh, cool ones down there. This little corner of the tank gets absolutely no flow. Accumulates a lot of detritus, um, and the morphs seem to love it. They breed down there. So uh, why would you put any, put them anywhere else? Anyway, thanks guys. Thanks for watching. See ya.